everyone. Thank you for joining me tonight. I am actually going to do another haul video. I hadn't actually planned on doing any kind of makeup shopping today because I came down with this cold yesterday. But I had to drop off my daughter to meet a friend about 30 minutes away from where we live. And so in that city, I had not yet been to their big lots. And as everyone knows, that's been my favorite place to bargain shop lately, especially for makeup. So on the way home, I decided to stop by to see what they had. And I found um, some things that I wanted to share. One of the things that I really like that I hadn't found in any of the big lots so far is this uh, two drawer compartment. It's an organizer for scrapbooking paper, but I am going to use it to organize some of my makeup. It's, I think, perfect size for shadows and pigments and other kinds of makeup. So it has two drawers. Um, and I'll show you the makeup in just a couple of minutes. Um, a couple of things I wanted to show you first were... The, let's see, I bought this OPI Rapid Dry Top Coat, and that this one was $5. I like the OP li OPI line for nail products. And then I bought another one of these travel sets. It's one of those airline approved set of containers, and I bought them specifically for these containers, the ones that, they had three different sizes that are in that pack. There's this, which is a medium one, um, this is the smaller one, and this is the larger one. And I've been using these containers to store my NYX Ultra Pearl Mania loose shadows, like this. So for all of you that use this product, know it's kind of hard to get the product um, out of the kind of top that it comes with. So I've been transferring them to those containers. And so I bought some more because I still had more loose shadows to, um, that needed, uh, containers. And then the haul basically that I did today was mostly NYX. A lot of the stuff was neutral colors and palettes, so I'm not really going to do any swatches unless um, requested. So I'm going to open up the drawer here and start with the two trio palettes that I found. Um, one is a green in spring leaf, lime green, and green tea. So really pretty greens. And this one is kind of a pink purpley palette and the colors are baby pink, cotton candy, and spring flower. And then I found some singles. This one is in Nutmeg. This one is in Deep Bronze. This shade is Walnut. This color is Salmon. This is a dark brown. This one is called Frosted Flakes kind of a silvery color. And then, let's see, there's two blushes I found in colors that I didn't have already. So this one is called Silky Rose. It's a very pretty um, pink color. And then the other one is a darker color called hmm, Cafe. And also a pretty color that's uh, kind of a dark 
mochaish color. And I also found two jumbo pencils, one in slate, which is a the dark gray gunmetal type of color. And this one is in yogurt, which is a shimmery pink uh, peachy color. I also found some, uh, some more lip glosses. Um, this, sh this shade is in Lollipop. This other shade is in Natural. And then I found these darker shades um, that I will do a swatch. This one is called Sunrise. And I think this is probably the first reddish or dark pink gloss that I've Found, and that's the color right there. Um, this color is burgundy. And this one is actually a really pretty deep red. And the last color is called Gold Pink. And that color is a bit more purpley. And that's what that color looks like. So they're all pretty colors. Um, I really like them just because they're some darker colors and I don't have very many dark colored glosses. And the other two things I purchased were actually eyeshadow quads from Milani. This one is called Dream Baby and Neutrals. And the other one is called Dominoes. Dominoes. And this one is a really nice palette, actually, because there's like a a white, a dark silver, um, a beigey pink, and a black color that's uh, a shimmery black. I think this will be a fun palette to do a smoky eye. So those are the things that I found today at the Big Lots that I went to. Um, I was going to mention for some of you who are wondering why some of the Big Lots have Nick, some of them don't have much, some of them don't have any. And I've discovered that Big Lots, what they've done is they've bought, like, a, basically a whole closeout from a drugstore. Um, for example, like, all these products came from Eckerd. And what they do is they buy the whole lot and they put them in these clearance bins. They don't separate the products. So, the products really can vary from um, big lots to big lots. So, that's why I've been lucky at some and, um, you know, not so lucky at others. And I just wanted to share that with you um, because uh, that's my experience. I'm, I'm having fun going to all of them to um, look for stuff. But... Um, yeah, it's it's a brand. These are brands that they don't carry all the time. Um, this is really just because they, uh, like I said, bought out a a drugstore um, and are just putting out the products in their clearance sections. So, 
Okay, well, that's my haul for today. I hope you guys like it. Um, let me know if you have any um, requests or swatches that you want me to do. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!